Yo, what is good, my VGA crew or whatever? Welcome back to my channel. So today, you guys, I could not resist myself. Once again, I am doing Mexican sushi. However, I am doing just my favorite rolls, which is the finiquera, the aguacatito, and the um, aguachile. I was going to get the mango roll, but they were out of mango, so I went with this one. And then right here, we have a coco con camarón. So this is a coconut filled with uh, cooked shrimp and all the good stuff. Anyway, you guys, let's go ahead and get started because I am suave. Heavenly Father, please bless this amazing food in the hands that prepared it. Please bless those that are going without Father in your precious name, I pray. Amen. All right, you guys. So I'm pretty sure y'all noticed my new intro song. The song is from one of my friends. Uh, we actually went to college together. She is a musician. The song is called Positiva, and it is from her album, Activa. Her name is Paulina Manzo, so you guys gotta hit her up. Her music is fire, yo. If you guys wanna hear the full version of this song and all the other songs of hers, you can search her on Apple Music, Spotify, just to name a few. I will also leave all her information and link her YouTube channel um, in my description box below. Y'all, she is amazing. Y'all got... And this song, Don't I Speak the Truth? La gente que nos envidia, que nos tienen celos, but we still doing what we doing. And we racking up la cuenta de banco. Like, what's good? What's good, honey? Keep hating while we keep growing. Toot toot. Anyway, let's go ahead and get into this. I... I have been craving this for so long. You guys, I don't, I don't think I want to do a lot of talking today just because I'm so hungry. All right. So to the people saying this sushi had a lot of rice, it does have somewhat a lot of rice, but um, it's bomb. The texture of the rice is amazing. Okay. Mm. Oh my God. Mm. Wow. Mm. Yo. Take a look at that. That's that our chili on top. Oh, man. Wow. <laughs> wow. I am so sad for those of you that do not have Mexican sushi available to you. Wow. Okay, I'm not going to show the first, the end, the first roll. Because that's always like the, the back end never has a lot of like stuffing, so... Mm. And again, for those of you that are going to ask, this sushi is from Sushi Mocorito Restaurante. This one has carne salad, cream cheese, and avocado on top. Oh yeah, we're going to dip it in this. The spicy mayo. Sorry, it's chipotle mayo. Fire. This is like real. Ooh. Ooh. Mmm. 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 Mm. Can't let it go to waste. Mm. Look at that. Mmm. 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 
And of course, it ain't a BGA mug bean without me getting something on my shirt. Oh. Yo, that cream cheese fire. Hold up. Ooh. That carne asada. Well, before we get into my my favorite roll, I want to get into this bad boy. So they put like almost like a shrimp and crab ceviche in it and all around. Mmm. Oh my god. Wow. That is good. Of course, we need my Santa La Negra. Oh, man. This is fire. Mmm. Oh, man, that is so refreshing. And it has chunks of coconut in it. Mmm. Wow. Ma! You want some of this cocoa? Why? No, come and get a little bowl. Please? <laughs> come and get some. <laughs> Please, I gotta cut this out. <laughs> mm. All right, let's go ahead and dig into this baked roll. In my last Mexican sushi video, I already described what is all in here, what all we are working with. Oh man, we're gonna need a spoon for this one. I put it in the uh, air fryer when I got home just to make sure it's super, super hot. So it's super hot. Mm. Mm. Oh my God. Get a little bonus spoon, man. <laughs> mm. Wow, I'm gonna play a little bit of my friend's song in a bit just because I want to jam out to it. It is so amazing. Mm. Oh my lord. And then I got a uh, black raspberry ice. Uh, oh, that's so good. Uh, right now, let me see if I can get these. Okay. I'm going to be needing to eat that with a spoon. Yep, that's all right. Uh huh. <laughs> Want to come around? Oh my god! Oh my god! It is stuffed. Yeah, but not I'm not going to be able to. Can you leave me this spoon and get another one? Because mm -hmm. that big spoon's not going to fit in here. Like yeah, which one? Uh, que no tenga chile. Aguacatito. Mm. Mm. 
this one. Okay. You want uh, aguachile? No. Or the big one? No. All righty. I could have made the opening a little bigger, but dang. Yo, this one, this is $18.99. But it's worth it. Look at how stuffed it is. Mmm. This is coconut. Oh my god, the coconut is so soft. Oh, they shave all of the coconut off in the inside. I can see the wall of the coconut. It's all shaved. Mmm. Oh man. Oh man. Man, oh man. So let me show y'all the guachile. This one's my favorite. I love it. Mm. I was low key sad. They didn't have any mango because y'all know I love the mango one. This one right here, about to be a big one. Mm-hmm. Yep. Put it on top. Okay. Come on, work with me. Please don't fall like last time. Wow. Wow. This is so fire. <clears throat> mm. <clears throat> this one is a little... It might, like, fall apart on you a little bit. You just gotta find a way to eat it. Because it's baked. It's hot. There's, you know, the, the mayo, the uh, chipotle mayo on it. So you just got to work your way around. Oh, big bite. Y'all go show her some, some love. Download her song. Y'all gotta download this song. Hmm. And like I said, if you want to hear it, it's on YouTube as well. So, heck yeah. Oh my gosh. I know she's gonna do big things. <clears throat> big things for sure. Hmm. She's already doing big things. What am I talking about? Hmm. I can't believe how cool this is. Hmm. And it's ice cold. And they had clamato. Mmm. 
I can definitely taste the Clamato in here. Oh yes, give me that. Look at that coconut. Ah, oh, just fell back in. Mm. Look at that. That's a chunk of coconut right there. Mm. If I'm not mistaken, I believe this is a young coconut, which is why the flesh is super, super soft. <clears throat> the coconut meat inside, it is super baby soft, like borderline gelatin. Um, but I think it's because it's a it's a young coconut. So, yeah. Anywho, all right. Let's dig into these sushi rolls. That's what they call them rolls. I was like, what? <laughs> oh man. Mmm. Mmm. Bacon. I forgot there's bacon on you. I'm still jamming out to her song, man. Mm. Amazing. All right, you guys. Well, thank you so much for chilling with me. I hope that you guys enjoyed this Mexican sushi video. Um, I hope you guys sat down and ate something delicious with me. And if you're ever in Phoenix, Arizona, make sure you hit up Sushi Mocorito. Again, I'm not sponsored by this uh, restaurant at all. I paid for everything myself. I just really love their sushi. Some, I was reading bad reviews on them and I mean, I could kind of see how some people feel, but it's so delicious to me. Like some people said that the texture of this sushi is super soft and mushy <clears throat> and that, um, that it's sweet, that rice, Japanese rice, sushi rice should not be sweet. And those are actually the things that I love about this sushi. So yes, the rice is soft. It's not, I wouldn't say mushy, but it is a very soft, delicate texture. And it does have a very light, light, I mean light, sweetness to the rice. It's not like a donut or a cake or something like that, no. And um, you know, they are uh, the, the toppy, the fillings, you know, are a little, huh, you know? But, you know, they don't put as much filling in it, that I will admit. Um, however, the toppings that they put on top of each sushi is so suffice, like it makes up for what they don't put inside the roll. So, I mean, I love it a lot. This, is, this sushi is like absolutely delicious, but I can definitely see how some people might not like that or how it might not be as appealing to some people, but hey, to each their own. What I always say is the only way to know if you're gonna truly like something is if you go ahead and try it. So give it a try. This right here, 10 out of 10. Absolutely, this was amazing. I would order this again. It is loaded with coconut chunks and seafood and veggies and Clamato and all that good stuff. So I highly recommend it. It's $18.99 for, for this. And yeah, well anyway, as always, thank you so much to my BGA crew for your love and support. If you're watching this and you're not yet a part of the BGA crew, you know what to do. Hit that subscribe button down below and ring that notification bell so you are notified every time that I upload a new video and any time that I go live. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. Until next time, besitos.